you know who Groot is? So Groot uh, is, uh, you know, a fantastic creature from cartoon, which is uh, something like a tree. The singer keeps grabbing and pulling invisible apples. Grab the apple, throw the apple. I love this new song from Avery Lavigne. This is cartoon metal. This band irritates me. Did Dragon Force go trans? Hi everybody, I'm Jade from Frozen Crown and today I will react to some of your comments under our videos on YouTube. So, let's start. Scusa, ma questo già devo leggere? Ovviamente no. Ah, ok. Ok, so I'm ready. <laughs> the worst of this song is that it lasts 5.09 minutes and one day has approximately 100, 1440 minutes which means that I can only listen to it 282.9 times a day Okay, yes but we have three full albums, full length albums. You can put every one of them. It would be, in my opinion, a better way to spend the day. Don't forget to check out our official store, frozencrown.bcartel.com for some exclusive merchandise and for our new album, Winterbane. Head exploded with joy watching this. Thank you very much. This is our mission. <laughs> I love this new song from Avery Lavigne. She has improved a lot. You know, I moved from Canada to here and I decided to go heavier. I didn't know that Marisha Ray sings in a band. <laughs> when did Professor Snape start playing drums? Uh, I think it comes from Harry Potter. Ah. Uh. No. Yes. I have no brilliant answer to this. Io la taglierei questa domanda qua per non far ridere comunque. Ma non fa ridere niente fino adesso. Thank you, Evil Groot, Italian Jon Snow and Metal Marisha Ray. Ok, I definitely have to check Marisha Ray. <laughs> and uh, Italian Jon Snow, yeah, it fits. You know who Groot is? So, Groot uh, is, uh, you know, a fantastic creature from cartoon, which is uh, something like a tree. No. Marvel character. Ah! And they're referring to the tyrant mask, because that's from the, the I am the tyrant video. The ah, tyrant mask. Ah, yes. No, I didn't know. Music makes me happy and is Cavalli is excellent. I need more details. <laughs> so this is an Italian comment. Top. Next year go to Eurovision. Okay, yes, because you know this year that Italian band. Okay, Italia. Due patatone allucinanti. So English translation is two big potatoes that are really cool. <laughs> that are really cool, allucinanti. How do two, you, would you translate two it? Two awesome big potatoes. Two awesome big potatoes, yes. Big because patatone, one. We are so beautiful that we are not a simple potato, we are a huge potato. Huge potatoes. Huge yes. potatoes. Thank you very much. I'm here for the music. I'm here for the music. <laughs> Thank you very much. Me and Fabiola, we will take this as a compliment. But maybe you were talking about Federico. Cool. She looks like to be a summit in the early years with makeup. This song is very good. That's not bad. I have a crush on Toby. <laughs> they aren't frozen anymore. The vocalist is too hot. There is no idea in the music. It's a poor track. This is cartoon metal. Yeah, try to blame me. You know, cartoons are liked by everybody, so if we do cartoon metal, we are happy. Did Dragon Force go trans? What do you mean? This band irritates me. This would be an amazing song if it had a singer, male or female, with range and diversity. But it's never going to get that because this is a husband and wife band. <laughs> wow. Mm, I did 
disagree with you. Solo un commento del cazzo, bro. Crappy and all loving this post. Sad. Under this comment, Federico replied, must feel bad to be the only d***. <laughs> Front woman graduated from the Within Temptation school of hand waving. Of course, Within Temptation is one of my influences, so, you know, how can I avoid grabbing from her this charm? The singer keeps grabbing and pulling invisible apples again and again while singing. You got the technique. Grab the apple, throw the apple, grab the apple, throw the apple. Jade outdoes herself again, but for the next video, more hand motions like in Never Ending. <laughs> my DNA is Italian, so I have to move my hands every second of my life. As all Italians, she don't just talk, but sings with her hands. Beautiful and talented, as a whole band. Thank you very much. Course. Didn't know Timo Cotipelto had another band. <laughs> Didn't know he had such sexy legs as well. <laughs> I am the daughter of Timo Cotipelto. Covid-19 is the greatest hoax in human history. Cashless society and AI enslavement is the goal of the globalist. But the globalist shall stumble. That's a spicy meatball, I like it. Yes, me too. <laughs> there was a reference to a commercial, you don't know that? No, I don't know. Ah, okay. That's a spicy meatball. Ah! It was the Alka Seltzer, if I'm not wrong. Okay. That's meant to say, like, uh, it's more than I can handle or something. Wow. Today I learned a new thing, but I'm sorry, I didn't know it before, so I didn't got the joke. <laughs> yeah, no, but it's quite a, it's a quite old commercial, so... Okay. Baby Metals, Moa Metal, said in a magazine interview that they love your music very much. I knew it and visited here. Thank you very much. We are really, really happy that Mo Metal is supporting us so much. Thanks, Baby Metal. It would be great to meet you someday in Japan. <laughs> Every single one of them look like they are in their own separate hair commercial. Fructis for uh, silky hair. This is in Italian. <laughs> really ex... Uh, <laughs> best shampoo advertising I've ever seen. Greatest shampoo and lotion ad in history. Thank you very much. Video sponsored by Pantene, best hair conditioner since 1945. Yes. But, you know, it was better if you said L'Oreal because I could reply to you with I'm worth it. Pantene, I, I don't know which is the slogan. <laughs> A version of this with Italian lyrics and vocals would be incredible and fun. No, I think it would suck. People have a fixation with us playing our stuff in Italian. I really don't understand why uh, people are always asking us to sing in Italian. It would be incredible. It would be incre no, it would be incredibly bad. I should have more songs in Italian, not only in English, but this is a f masterpiece. That song is a masterpiece. No, it's a masterpiece because it's not in Italian. So please tell me where are you from, because I want to understand. <laughs> I really want to understand why people from everywhere have this fetish for Italian songs. I always really liked the Italian songs from Rhapsody. Are you planning to make Italian songs or maybe Italian versions of your songs? I think it would be a nice idea because it would be easier to really put your heart in it. Thanks for your music. No, I disagree, you know, there are enough Italian songs from Rhapsody and uh, the world doesn't need any more Italian metal songs. You know, uh, for me, uh, that I'm used to singing in English, singing in Italian would be crazy, I won't put my heart on it. It has different metrics, we, you know, we create the songs directly in English. Is this a metal family or what's the story here? Oh, 
So this is long. Rose and Crown are the perfect family. Iki is the wise and charming uncle everybody wants at their family reunion dinner. Nizo is the jumpy, handsome, yet a little bit nerdy, genius artist son. Fabiola is basically a funnier and older version of Lisa Simpson. Jade is the beloved mother. Sweet, patient, protective. Federico is the father. He takes care of everything and everybody. Takes the hard decision, bearing all the weight on his shoulders. I think you definitely need to come uh, and have a dinner with us and you will completely change your mind. You know, this fan fiction usually make me really uncomfortable. Okay, this is long. I must be awesome to be Federico Ondelli. Just sing for a minute, the guy leads and manages one of the most successful power metal bands of the last years. He can write and arrange a plethora of hit songs in the matter of minutes. He sings and grows like a beast, plays guitar with insane technique and incredible taste. He's a video director and a visual artist, as well as a designer. And, last but not least, he's married to that incredibly hot piece of heavenly cupcake, <laughs> who's, of course, not only one of the most beautiful girls in the scene, but also an incredibly gifted singer, a successful dentist and an amazing person as well. Would not be surprised to know that the guy is a complete asshole, as it could be pretty much impossible to remain humble after reaching all these accomplishments. You got it. <laughs> but in fact, if I'm not wrong, I commented to the guy below, yes, I'm an asshole. He is. If you liked this video, remember to put a like, subscribe to our channel. If you like this, ah, don't forget to share it. Remember, if you like this video, share it with your friends, put a like, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.